Good morning, students. The Rajkumar College, Rajkot. My name is Kshitij Mehta. I teach computer science for Form 6 also. We are going to start with first chapter, Computer Language. What is language? It is the medium to express our feeling and expression. To communicate with a computer, we need a language, which computer understands. For every action, the computer needs to be given instructions. A diagrammatic representation is shown over here. This is human and this is computer, a machine. So for communication between both of us, a common language has to be there. A language by which a computer understands what the human wants to inform and give a proper output according to the need of the user. Let us understand with an example. I am communicating right now with you. The language which I have selected is English. Why? Because it is easier for you to understand what I wanted to convey to you. Similarly, you can understand the language which I am right now communicating that is English because you can understand that language and based on that if I ask you some questions you will give me the answer in English as you also understand the language and respond me back in the language which I have conveyed to you. And that is how we complete a communication cycle. Now, when we are dealing with the machine, machine, how the humans are interacting with the machine? Humans are interacting with the machine by giving them various commands, various instructions and getting the desired output. Let us understand this with an example. Say for example, I want to work in MS Windows and using the operating system, I want to open an application which will help me to take a printout of a letter which I need to type in a proper way if errors are any there has to be removed and have a proper presentation presentable manner a printout has to be taken for that which application will you suggest it is ms word how you are going to give instructions to the computer or the commands by clicking on start second step by clicking on all programs third step by clicking on ms office fourth step by clicking on the icon of ms word ms word windows will open in front of you you can type the letter in a presentable manner You can 
check your letter whatever you have typed if any errors are there you can remove that error recheck the work what you have done once you are sure then you can give a printout how it is possible with the help of mouse with the help of keyboard you give the instructions to the computer which is a machine which will respond to you back by opening that ms word opening that operating system opening ms word allowing you to type allowing you to recheck and giving the final printout so the communication has been established between you and the machine with the help of commands and instructions given by you so we can say that with the help of language we are able to communicate with the machine so that is all about language now let's move forward program and programming what is a program a set of instructions which tells computer what to do is called as a program that means you need to give instructions to the computer to get the work done the process of writing specific instructions in a computer language is called programming each programming language has its own specific rules and syntax syntax means the way you can write that command in a program powerful application programs which can solve any task today are been developed by programmers so the people who write this kind of program are called as program now we'll move further in understanding various development of computer languages the computer languages are bifurcated into various generations this is the first generation in which machine language was used that means it was the combination of zeros and ones to write a program in second generation language it used assembly language in which mnemonic codes were used instead of zeros and ones which was used in machine language then came the third generation language which is high level language example of such languages are fortran pascal c c++ basic java then came the fourth generation language which is called as high level language example of such language is csp xs apl 
and then came the 5GL that is the five, fifth generation language which is very high language used for artificial intelligence. Let us understand each generation in which this is the machine language which is also called as first generation language. What is this machine language made up? It is the only language that a computer understands. How it is expressed? It is expressed in binary code that is zeros and one. Like what is zero is called as? Zero is called as off state and one means on state. So you have to find a combination of zeros and one to write any particular character or a program. It has advantage of very high speed and very low memory utilization. It is very difficult to write and debug programs because you can understand well with the combination of zeros and one and shown you the example of what zero is called in uh, binary digit this is also called as binary digits that is combination of zero and one if you type zero that means zero zero one one zero 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 this is the combination if you want to type one according to machine 0, 0, 1, 1, 0, 0, 0, and 1 is called as machine language if you want to type a which is shown over here character a according to the machine a means 0, 1, 0, 0, then 0, 0, 0, 1. so it becomes very complicated to find an error and debug means debug means removing an error it is very difficult to write and debug program using the binary digits. It is extremely machine dependent. A machine language written for one computer may or may not run on another computer. That means using these codes during that time, the older time, when it was in the primitive stage the program written using these codes that is binary code that is 0 and 1 meant for one computer may or may not work if it is installed in another computer that it wants to say so that's why many people did not opt for specialization in machine language it's low level language these are the standard codes used in machine language as an example over here